All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and I am back at it again with some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 DLC Pack 15 news and speculation with a little bit of Dragon Ball Legends, uh, I guess, speculation and news. We got a little teaser and reveal from Dragon Ball Legends earlier this morning, which I want to show, but uh, the... The whole idea of uh, wh what I'm going to be discussing in this video is the integration of Pan. <laughs> I know that's really weird and it, it's random, but it's something that I didn't even think about. And I don't think she would be included specifically in this pack, but there's always a possibility that they drop her next pack. Again, we have no idea how many characters we're going to be getting in the next pack. So let's go over this teaser real quick. Uh, I'm sure you guys already saw it now. You guys know the Dragon Ball Legends teasers are they're they're phenomenal. They're fantastic. I love them. Uh, you know, most of the time they're pretty easy to um, you know figure out, but sometimes they're they're just like random as hell. Like, <laughs> the, who remembers the snow cone one? Y'all remember the snow cone one? So uh, they dropped a picture of some leaves slash blades of grass that are just kind of flowing through the wind. Now at first it, it kind of it I think it clicks for everyone. You know, if you if you've been uh, you know, if you watch the superhero movie and everything, Pan, whenever she is trying to learn how to fly when she's training with Piccolo, okay, it's even in some of the trailers. You can rewatch the trailer if you want. But while she's powering up, there are blades of grass and leaves kind of flowing through. It was in the very first trailer without any audio, the very first teaser that we ever got, I believe, earlier or sometime last year. If I'm not mistaken. Um, and it was hype because it was like, whoa, is she, is she, everyone's like, is she gonna go Super Saiyan or some shit? So. Uh, yeah, that teaser makes a lot of sense. I just want to see some of the responses here. Legend's really telling us to touch grass, bro. They telling all Dragon Ball fans to touch grass. Me included. I need to do that too, bro. Or maybe we should be touching ass. I don't know. Which one, guys? Um, I also like grass. Connor, if you will. <laughs> no fucking way. Superhero pan. Oh, shit. Let's get it. Toshi smoking the Legends player pack. I'm going to be honest, man. Toshi, whenever he's in these, uh... And these reveals and stuff, he's a little bit glazed over. He's like, where am I? So, I mean, the, the, the decisions that he's making are very questionable. So, he, he must be on that 420 shit, bro. Um, look at that. There it is. There's the clip right there. Perfect. So, yeah, that's, that's literally it, guys. That's This is literally it right here. Blades of grass flying in the wind because she's charging up, bro. I think Videl even did that, too, if I'm not mistaken, when she first started to fly. Oh, my God, the references. Oh. <gasps> No way, guys. Are we getting Vegeta again? No way. I think we actually already have this Vegeta in Dragon Ball Legends. I think he's an extreme unit. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, the Twitter replies are always the best to watch. See? Touch grass. Um, I don't know. Oh, be sure to take a closer look. Oh, God. Do they always... I forgot they did this as a teaser. What is up with the them and the grass, man? They really, really trying to tell us. So, um, Dragon Ball Legends, okay? Superhero Pan. I hope it's this version of her, okay? I mean, there, there, there were what, like two versions? The one where she's wearing the school uh, little fit, and then we have this one here. I'm pretty sure it would be this one. But how does Superhero Pan work in a combat type of game like Dragon Ball Legends and Xenoverse 2? Well... Pan from GT, who, I mean, she's a little bit older. Okay, she's a little bit taller. But, I mean, they're pretty much, they're pretty similar. You know what I'm saying? You know? So they could just, they literally could, if they wanted to, give her the same combos. Um, now, when it comes to Xenoverse 2, give her everything that she already had. Uh, maybe, I mean, she does fight in the movie, right? She does, you know, pulverize some of the Red Ribbon Army soldiers and stuff. So she, she has a little bit of fighting time in there uh, obviously we know by the end of the movie she can fly so in dragon ball legends it would work and in xenoverse 2 you know you, you you'd be able to fly and they, what they do with videl is i don't think we've ever seen dell at dell videl actually use key blast to like blast mofos but she does you know show that she can use energy you know what i mean because she had to learn it in order to fly whenever she's training with gohan and she actually performs it you see the energy sphere you know, between her hands whenever she's charging it up in the anime and obviously the manga and stuff too. So, um, I'm pretty sure they would give Pan Key Blast, like, no problem. Like, she she could be a playable character. It's just that she doesn't have that much material to go off of. And like I said, in Xenoverse 2, you guys know, they're just... If they did integrate her, which, I mean, there is, there is a possibility that they could. Not specifically, again, in this DLC pack, but maybe in the second one. 
Um, just because she was like also one of the big main characters of this film. Okay, I would say she was more of like a secondary type of protagonist. So there's a word for that. I forgot. It's like maybe it starts with a D. You guys let me know what that word is. I mean, I'll look it up later. But, um, you know, Piccolo and Gohan, they're the they're the meat. They are the meat of this uh, movie. But Pan is pretty important too, okay? They had a lot of focus on her in this film and stuff. And she's she was basically the trigger for Gohan, you know, uh, you know, awakening, reawakening his power. And then obviously Piccolo getting fucked up, uh, gave him the beast shit. So, man, that would be pretty cool if we had Pan... Uh, Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo. Just saying. Because, I mean, like, Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo, they're really cool. The forms are badass. But, again, they didn't have... I mean, Piccolo had a lot more screen time in Orange form more than anything else. But Gohan had one horizontal kick, one sideways kick, and then the special bean cannon. That is it. That is it. So, it's like, I don't know what else they can give him. And if they really want to make this pack worth it, I feel like they would include at least one more character. Maybe even more than that. I don't know, man. Superhero Goten and Trunks? All they did were a couple key blasts, bro. <laughs> Go Goten did use the Kamehameha, though, which was sick. I, I shit my pants. I was hyped as hell whenever he did that. But, yeah, uh, what do, what do we give her? Like, Super Maiden Blast or whatever, Full Power Energy Wave. Would they give her the Power Paradance or whatever? Because that's from GT. I don't know if they would actually do that. But, I mean, Pan has some skills. Okay, she has some stuff that she could she could use. Uh, Dragon Ball Legends and Dokkan are a lot more realistic to have these characters, obviously. Um, since, I mean, that's what's being teased. Because uh, there's not a lot that they give you in, in Dragon Ball Legends. In Dragon Ball Universe 2, they give you a new move set, full-on, you know, new skills and everything. Uh, there's a lot that they have to uh, integrate into it compared to Dragon Ball Legends. Dragon Ball Legends is, okay, you know, they give her a couple of, like, three combos, <laughs> three-hit combo or whatever, and then they have... Um, an ultimate, and sometimes they give her a spe give them a special move and stuff. So, uh, hey, I would play this. If anything, let's get this costume for Cac. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. Would you actually like to see Pan, the superhero version of Pan, as a playable character in Xenoverse Two? Like I said, we're probably most likely getting her in Legends from the teaser. Um, but for this pack specifically, I think it's going to be Gamma One Two. Transforming Gohan and Transforming Piccolo. That makes the most sense for me for this one. I'm going to stay true to that. But I just threw in Pan here uh, just to add an idea because if Dragon Ball Legends is getting it, you know, they already have the model. It's the same developers and everything. Why not? All right, guys. Just a little fun speculation. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, ring my notification bell, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> this is Broly, and you are watching Slow Plays. Make sure to subscribe, or else I'll destroy your entire planet! <laughs>